Freedom to it again to me means uh, you get to design your lifestyle. That's it. It's the closest thing you can do to a miracle is to help someone change social economic status. We are gonna only sell what works. If, if you wanna change your life, there's gonna be work and not everyone can put in the work that is yeah. needed for this. Exactly. When it comes to our E3 family, we are trying to expand in the areas of abundance, wellness, and freedom. And if we're gonna have abundance and if we're gonna have financial freedom, that means we need to be making more money. We need to have something, a tool, a vehicle that's gonna help us get there. And I'm super excited about today's show because we're gonna expose you to this tool that will help you make more money. You can do this on the side, you can do this full time. You can do this however and whenever you wanna do it. But as I was thinking about today, you guys know me, in 2024, I'm trying to start off with a scripture that allows us to really dive into the today's topic. And the scripture that came to mind today was Colossians chapter three, verses 23. And it says, whatever you do, work at it with all your heart as working for the Lord, not for human masters. Since you know that you will receive inheritance from the Lord as a reward, it is the Lord Christ you are serving. Verse 23 says, work at it. So no matter what you're doing, whether you're working for Wendy's, KFC, Fortune 500 company, working for yourself, you're going to work at it with all of your heart. And I believe if we can find the right income revenue streams, that's going to help us generate more money. It will help us pay off our debt. It will help us be, have more abundance. It will help us get to the financial freedom to where we could do whatever we desire to do. But before we get into today's topic and, and today's special guest, I want to remind you to, to join the E3 family, man, where we are focused on expanding on the areas of wellness, the areas of abundance, and the areas of freedom. That's all we're doing in the year 2024. I'm not sitting here exposing y'all to stuff that's this get rich quick scheme and talking about the most popular subjects. If it doesn't help us in the areas of abundance, wellness, or freedom, that crap is not on this show and it's not at the table. But today I'm excited because we have someone a very special person um, who has built a seven figure business and who has helped others make, you know, a lot of money transitioning into career fields and helping them get into the areas of abundance, wellness and freedom through he and his wife's company. So, ladies and gentlemen, can y'all help me welcome after you hit that subscribe button to the table for the very first time, but not the last time, my friend Juby from Yellowtail Tech, man. What's going on, bro? I'm well, man. Thank you for having me. Hey, man. Thank you for coming, man. You caught an Uber over here to our new studio, man. Yeah, I love it. It's 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 nice. I mean, it, you know what? I got to say this, bro. You are the first person in the studio. The thank first you, guest, you. the first show in a new studio. Yeah, and it's beautiful and it's coming along. I love it. Hey, man. I you even have it. a great room for me to yeah. just hang out. Hey, in. man, don't tell them everything we got here, Doc. Don't tell them everything we got over here. But, you know, we're trying to step up when it comes to the, when it comes to the level of excellence. Yeah, man, yeah, we're really yeah. Trying I see it. To, I see um, it. Especially in the black world, we're really trying to have that level of excellence for yeah. all of our guests that come in. But thank you for, for coming, bro. Um, yeah. and, and I'm super excited about what we're doing here. But I, I want to talk about you because. Um, you and your company, Yellowtail, have made millions. And so clearly you and your wife have a lifestyle. But in process of doing that, you've helped people cross over into career fields that has really, really helped them experience more abundance and more wellness and freedom. One of the things I believe that if we can have, you know, a job that's paying us anywhere from 70, 80,000 on up, it allows us to have a sense of peace in our minds. Yeah. Because we're not stressed about, oh my God, do I have the money to pay for it? Yeah, I I'm curious for you, and I want to go back to your childhood. Uh, before you had this successful company, before you and your wife started really helping thousands of individuals uh, make more money, I, I want to ask you why. Because I mean, we're going to get yeah. to Yellowtail, mm -hmm. Yellowtail Tech of why you're doing this and why this is so different from anything else that we've had on our show. Uh, but why? In your own words, why does financial what does financial freedom mean to you? To me personally, financial freedom uh, means um, not only you have freedom to actually decide where you live, mm -hmm. where you put your kids to school, mm -hmm. being in a good uh, uh, neighborhood allows that. 
but it also uh, gives you uh, the freedom to actually expose your children to, that's what I was able to do, expose your children to uh, experience that's going to enlarge their world. Yeah, yeah. And um, to me, financial freedom also means uh, the freedom of time. Yeah. Because, you know, we were talking about our, our, our work schedule. Yeah. When you have financial freedom, you can decide the days you work. Yes, yes. And to me, that's important because a lot of people, they focus on making more money. But um, after you make the money, you have to have time to, to actually enjoy um, some, you know, time with your family. Yeah. And that's also what I usually tell some people who come to me and they say, well, um, you know, transitioning into tech can make you uh, 80 or $100,000, but I'm making that. Mm. But I'm like, okay, how many hours you work? Mm. Yeah, I work 50 hours and I put, you know, on average uh, 15 to 20 hours over time. And I end up with a, you know, a W2 of $120,000. I'm like, yeah, but it costs you more time. time. Mm. To me, financial freedom is all about time. Mm. It's not, it's actually, uh, less about the money, but how much time you buy back. Mm. So to me, that's, that's what it means. I'm curious right now, if you, if you don't feel comfortable to answer the question, don't do it. But how much time do you have? Do you work a uh, hundred hour weeks? Oh, no. Uh, <laughs> I, have, I, I have a team. Uh, shout out to my team. Um, yeah. They actually pretty much run the company. I'm, okay. I'm exactly where I want to be now where I'm thinking ahead, I'm looking around the corners, yeah. I'm trying to grow this at a sustainable rhythm. Yeah, yeah. So I don't flame out of existence like I see other training centers, ha yeah. you know, it happens often. Yeah. I don't, I, 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 I didn't have to take uh, venture uh, money mm. to build this, so I'm not um, beholden to anyone, so I can literally build this at the rhythm I think that's sustainable which other uh, other uh, um, institution like me don't have that uh, um, don't have that luxury yeah because the venture capitalists they need 20 percent year over year, year over year growth it doesn't matter what you do cheat lie or steal you need to deliver this because it's you know that's that's the deal yeah me uh, seeing that I we grew and I, we could talk about how yeah. my program started literally from, you know, my living room with my, with my wife, because uh, my wife was transitioning into IT. I have an IT background okay. and I helped her transition. Yeah. And through, uh, we spent two years just helping friends and family. Yeah. We didn't have an offering. We didn't have a program. We were helping people. Yeah. And then um, from 2014 to 2016, that's what we were doing. And then we'll, we were like, you know what? We have something valuable for, for the marketplace. Right, right. And then we started offering it um, to uh, the community, the Haitian community mostly, because okay. I'm from Haiti. Okay. And it, 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 it grew from there. Wow. It grew from there. But uh, it definitely came from mostly from helping my wife transition into IT. Now she's uh, all, uh, helping me run the company. She, of course, went out um, to uh, have a, a, a great career in, um, in the tech world. And uh, 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 she worked for, you know, Fortune 500 mm -hmm. for, a few, for a few years. And now she's back mm -hmm. um, to help me grow this. Mm -hmm. yeah. I think one of the key things you said is like, which I love is you say, yeah, man, you're going out there and you're working, you know, 80 hours and then you're working an extra 20 hours to only make a hundred thousand dollars a year. When my team last year, the two individuals who made over a hundred thousand, uh, they work five days a week up until June. July, they had two weeks off, came back August. They only worked Monday through Thursday. Yep. November, they had a whole week off. December, they had two and a half weeks off. And still made way over $100,000. Yeah. It's like my team. Uh, we, we take off from uh, December this year. It, uh, from uh, uh, December 19th, we came back on the 8th or 9th. Wow. 
of January. I think it's very important to have that balance, yeah. to uh, afford your team that balance as well. Yeah, yeah. It's very important. It's very important to me. Um, freedom, to it, again, to me means uh, you get to design your lifestyle. That's it. That the is lifestyle it. design is mm -hmm. something, it, it might sound fancy, it's just, it just means you get to choose what you do with your time. Yes. And you can actually choose that because you have the means to yes. do it. Yes, yes. Because we all want to do more with our time. We just Absolutely. Afford, we, we just can't all afford it. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I'm right there with you. And I mean, I really do. It's, I feel as if my team's productivity level is is higher. Yeah. Because they know, okay, listen, if I can just bust my butt Monday through Thursday, I get a three day weekend forever yeah. now. Productivity, efficiency. Yes. And also clarity in how they actually support you too. Yeah. You see? Yeah. Because if you're not overworked, if you always stay in the state where you are able to, you know, produce at a higher level, you know, it's it's gonna it's gonna show. And this is why I wanted you to come on the show. And this is why I wanted to have a conversation with, with you because when I was doing my research on the career fields that you're helping people get into, a lot of them are working from home. Oh yeah. A lot of them are making good money. I mean, I think starting right around 70, 80 and going on upwards into the six figures. But what I love about it, it's really not just about the income they have coming in, it's the hours. Oh yeah. I was doing some research. Some people were even like taking vacations uh, and working on yeah, their vacations. Yeah, yeah. It's, 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 it's a few things. It's the hours. Yeah. It's the flexibility. Yep. It's the um, most definitely the remote aspect mm -hmm. of it. Mm -hmm. Because um, since COVID hit, I think um, we've only placed, helped place three students that had to go to the office full time. So the world is a new world. It I is. can tell you right now. It is. The going to the office nine to five, Monday to Friday is gone. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that has changed as well. Mm -hmm. And now um, companies are understanding productivity doesn't always happen between Monday and Friday, nine to five. Once you afford more uh, flexibility, it actually yields more productivity. It's it, it's actually counterintuitive. It is. But it does. Mm -hmm. It does uh, um, um, yield more productivity to them now. So uh, now they save on, uh, on on space. You save on commute. Yep. Everybody's happier. Their bottom line is bigger. Mm -hmm. And um, it, it, it offers that flexibility. Yeah, no, that's true. We are in our new building now. We have a new building that we I'm having DC and I told my team at first, ah, oh, we're gonna come in every day. And then I noticed their spirit and even my spirit got a drop. And I was like, I gotta come in every single day. So now we come in on Tuesdays and Wednesdays because it's content days, shoot days. But then Monday and Thursdays, we work from home and then Fridays yeah. we're all off. Okay. And I think the important part, what you're teaching, you're placing people, hey, it's not just about the income, but we're gonna give you flexibility. And if you are wise and steward this flexibility well, you can generate other money on the side. Yeah. As long as, you, as you're getting your job done. I'm curious, what kind of jobs are Yellowtail helping people transition to? Yes. We focus on two specific career tracks okay. in tech, which okay. is Linux system administration okay. and cloud system administration. This is where you're administering cloud environments. Mm. These are the specific two areas. Okay, well, go, go back with Linux. Help people understand, what is Linux? Linux is just an operating system, just like um, Windows. Okay. You, you actually run a version of uh, Linux. Okay. Mac runs an older version of uh, Linux, but, um, but Linux is just an operating system, but it's mostly used in enterprise environments. Okay. So um, your um, Amazon, Google, uh, uh, Facebook, they run their servers on Linux. Okay. Because it's more scalable, it's more um, secure, and it's uh, definitely uh, more modular. So okay. you literally use the parts of it you need. Okay. 
But what, the reason why most people don't know much about it, it's because it's a back end type of it's not uh, forward operation. facing thing. It's it's not forward facing, and it's not uh, for consumers to to uh, to use. Okay. Um, you interact with it, but you don't know if you if you have an Android phone, it That's runs Linux. Linux. If you have a microwave, it runs Linux. What? If you have a smart TV, it runs Linux. It runs Linux. A Fire Stick, the uh, the operating system in the Fire Stick runs on Linux. Tesla, wow, runs on Linux. When wow. if you have a Tesla and you receiving updates, I'm sure you've heard. Yeah, your Tesla can get updated. Yeah, yeah, it's a Linux operating system. Wow. So uh, Linux is a very, very, very powerful. In fact, ninety percent of all the servers that are running uh, enterprise level compute power runs on Linux. Runs on Linux. Okay. So uh, we train you to uh, become a Linux system administrator in an enterprise environment. And what is that? So we're just administrating. We're not really building it, but we're just administrating. Exactly. We're, you're not building. You're not coding. Okay. Uh, it's it's on, uh, an alternative for people who, when they hear coding, you know, their hair blows. Even, yeah, yeah. Even me. You know? <laughs> I, I have a background in uh, um, in technology, but coding to me was always out of the question. Yeah, I hate coding. Yeah, so that's an alternative where um, you are managing infrastructure that's already established and you're just making sure it runs smoothly. Great. You see, uh, that's that's a Linux system administration. Um, the natural next step for us was um, to offer cloud computing because people don't know it, but AWS is run 100% on Linux. So AWS, that's Amazon. Amazon Web Services. Yep, and so that's cloud-based stuff. Yeah, but don't forget, cloud is just an abstraction of a real operating system somewhere else. You see, and a data center. Okay. And all those data center, they are they have servers that are running an actual operating system. Right, right, right. Called Linux. Yes. And so the AWS is working with Linux, but AWS is a cloud. Exactly. But I it's think the don't... it's the abstraction on top of the actual operating system called yeah. Linux. Yeah. Okay. And do we interact with that, the consumer? No. We don't. No, no. You don't need to. Okay. You don't need to. So that's more of an enterprise thing as well. Exactly. And um, there are several cloud, well, Microsoft has its own cloud offering, which is uh, Azure. Yeah. AWS um, has its own cloud, uh, 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 Amazon has its own cloud uh, offering called AWS, mm -hmm. but uh, AWS is run 100% on Linux. That's why we chose AWS for that, because it's the natural next step to what we offer to our expertise, because we don't want to step away too much from our subject matter expertise, which is Linux. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So it was the next step for us to actually offer that program. So for those watching right now, because one thing I've challenged them to do within my community year 2024 is to start a business or look into a different career field to help you generate more money. Yeah. If someone is just now hearing Linux and AWS for the very first time, mm -hmm. they're like, yo, I ain't never heard of this before. Yeah. Which one would you say that they should try to look into and why should that single mother of two kids, three kids, or that young man who just graduated college spent $100,000 yeah. on student loans? That's my story, by the way. $100,000 on No, 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 no. Uh, the part where, you know, I went to college for yes. IT, but I still needed additional training to be relevant on the marketplace. But wait, see, this This is, see, now you done shifted the whole daggone conversation. <laughs> How was it that you went to college, spent four years getting the education? Yeah. Wait, wait, wait we'll come back to that because I don't want to skip over this because I, I, I want the people part that we coming. What's going on, fam? I want to thank my friends over at BetterHelp for sponsoring today's show. And again, my name is Anthony O'Neill here. And today I want to chat about something that hits a little bit different, especially during today's day and time. You know, when I reflect on the relationships in my life that I'm most proud of, it strikes me how much effort it took to actually cultivate them. It's a common myth that relationships should be effort effortless to be meaningful. In reality, the strongest connections are often those we work hardest to fortify. While I've been on my own personal journey of personal growth, 
I've come to understand the immense value of having support along the way. It's not just about overcoming significant hurdles. It's also about learning to navigate everyday challenges, setting healthy boundaries, and striving to become the best version of yourself. And this is why I'm a huge fan of therapy. If you're considering therapy, I encourage you to check out my friends over at BetterHelp. Their service is entirely online, offering the convenience and flexibility to fit therapy into your life, not the other way around. And a simple questionnaire, you'll be matched with a licensed therapist suited to your personal needs. And if for any reason you feel your therapist isn't a perfect fit, you can switch at any time at no extra cost at all to you. So listen, before we get to today's show, Take the next step towards strengthening your relationships with yourself. Visit BetterHelp.com slash AO and get 10% off your very first month. Remember, that's BetterHelp.com slash AO. Become your own soulmate, whether you're actively looking for one or not. All right, let's grow together. But the people watching right now saying, oh, I've never heard of Linux. I've never heard of AWS, mm -hmm. but I genuinely want to make some more money. And it's not really about the money. I want more time to so where I can pick up my kids from school to where I could start my own small business, but I need something that's going to allow me to yeah. get that time. I want to start with a warning, though. Yeah. I want to make sure it's clear that transition into IT is not for everyone. That's good. Anthony. I want to make sure it's clear. Because we at Yellow Tail Tech, we really believe, it's actually one of our pillar mm -hmm. in terms of beliefs, that um, IT, we shouldn't be uh, encouraging uh, everyone to get into IT mm -hmm. because it down. requires um, a very specific personality. Okay. The first thing is you, you, you have to be uh, um, comfortable with the idea that you're gonna be learning for the rest of your life. Mm -hmm. This is something that's ever changing, that's evolving. For some people, that's exciting. Mm -hmm. It's amazing. It to is. me, that, that's the most amazing part of technology. For other people, they want to learn something, figure it out, and keep doing it for the rest of their lives. But you know what, though? You know, it, 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 ooh, ooh. I think those are the people who are broke. Mm. <laughs> you, know? you know what I'm saying? I mean, I'm just saying, if you're the kind of person you want to you want to learn something one time, and never learn anything else, then you're broke. Yeah. You're exactly. gonna say broke. But I, I hear what you're saying, because yeah. I agree. This is not for everybody. It's but... not for everybody. Yeah. And then you you have to have a, a little knack for it. And let me explain. Let me illustrate. Break that down. Um you don't need you absolutely because we cater specifically to people with no IT background. This is our niche. Mm -hmm. The the person who was a nurse who got, you know, who's burned out. The person like me who has a, a IT degree but who needs something additional, the person who's always a truck driver, an Uber driver, but you have to have the minimal computer literacy skills. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's why we test for that. Mm -hmm. You need to have minimal uh, uh, um, critical thinking skills. We test for that because there are predictive tests that we back, uh, we look at the data. Uh, the companies we work for, or we work with, uh, look at the data. There are some things you need to have mm -hmm. as an individual in terms of traits, in terms of intellect, to, for for this to work. Mm -hmm. You see, so you have to uh, have a minimal a minimum of um, um, computer literacy. Okay. So that's I, that. I want to just put that at, as a disclaimer. I love it uh, because um, people they hear tech, they hear. A hundred thousand dollars, and that's all they hear. They hear, yeah. You yeah. see, and I want to make sure that the right person gets in. And you mentioned, uh, yeah, to make more money, but you have to come in with the intention to learn this yes. because Anthony, they're not gonna hand you a hundred thousand dollars just because they like your face Ooh. or you got a certification. They're gonna hand you a thousand dollars, a hundred thousand dollars, because you are able to produce result, yes, to sir. solve problem, to yes, add sir. value. If it, trust me, if a company hands you a hundred thousand dollars, you are worth to them at least two and a half times. Yes, that you better be. Yeah, you know that's that's that, that's the rule of thumb. Right, and, and and you know whatever your salary is, you are able to produce in terms of results, a, a solution. Yeah. 
more than that. Yeah. You see what I mean? Yeah. So you need to study, you need to put in the work to actually be able to be worth Facts. A, 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 that amount. Facts. So people uh, usually disassociate the, um, the, the work and the value they're br going to bring and the money they're going to make. Mm -hmm. You see what I mean? Mm -hmm. So uh, um, you definitely have to uh, be the person who's interested, who has that value, that interest that mm -hmm. initial interest will will do the rest yeah yeah but you have to have the initial interest in it and okay. this and this this is why i love it and you guys just so you all know we're going to put their information in today's show notes you can go to anthonyoneal.com forward slash yellowtail uh, they are um looking for quality people who are truly interested in getting into the aws and linux field um they're not looking for a lot of people. No, no, we we definitely believe on uh, value yeah. over volume. Yes, that's a that's a that's a second pillar. I love it. I love it, and, and I think the reason why I love that is because I have a lot of people reach out to me. I'm like, yo, bro, I have this. I think it'd be great for your audience, and I I feel more like they're going for volume. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like we want a lot of people in. I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I said, but like. And that was one of the first thing you told me, was like, Anthony, I don't I don't want a lot of people. I just I want the quality people because I care about the, my reputation of our program. Yeah. Not only the reputation of our program, I care about you investing because, by the way, we are not the cheapest and we don't want we, we, we're not trying to do that uh, 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 race to the bottom who's cheaper. Gotcha. We are not the cheapest. Yeah. We want to be the best. We want to mm -hmm. be the subject matter expert mm -hmm. and we want to deliver. Yeah. Because having a bunch of people, yeah, you can have something cheaper, but you cannot deliver the, 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 the value yeah. promised. Yeah. So we are more focused on being able to, uh, to deliver on the value. So, so I, have a, mm -hmm. I have a question. So I've looked at your prices. I'm okay, definitely affordable. It's right in line with what I teach and what I believe, right? My biggest concern that I really want to ask you on the table is, okay, they make this investment. Mm -hmm. What's your success ratio after they yeah. complete your program? Because the last thing I want is to is my people like, all right, cool. I'm a, I'm a rock with yellow tail, but so many people are graduating and spend, spending fifty, sixty, seventy thousand dollars on a four-year degree. Still need to go spend another twenty grand mm -hmm. just to be qualified to get into the field. And then some of them spend it and don't even get into mm -hmm. that. What's y'all success yeah. rate with honestly planting people correctly and getting them yeah. a job? Our success rate is a sixty-eight percent um, job placement rate within six months after completing the apprenticeship, and then 78% if you uh, uh, look at this uh, uh, a year after. 78%, so nearly 80% of your people within 12 yeah. months. Who have completed, completed the, the program. apprenticeship. Because we have the training part, okay, and we have an apprenticeship where we funnel you, where you're doing the work, you put in the work, and uh, we, we, we have a, a partnership with a company to be able to actually funnel you into uh, uh, an apprenticeship to get the hands-on, to actually be able to talk in an interview and talk about the tools you've been using, you see? That's good. After that, it takes about six months to get you a job, on average. How long is your program? The, My pro the program by itself, without the apprenticeship? Yes. Uh, the Linux for job is six months. Okay. The um, cloud for jobs is 11 months. 11 months. Okay, cool. So pretty much with six months to a year, Yeah, you can have your education. Exactly. And then apprenticeship, I know what that is, but mm -hmm. can we break down exactly what that means for the individual? Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. So um, um, we are partners in a, in a different company called Procore Plus, mm -hmm. where um, the students, um, they once they pass their certification, they go into a project-based apprenticeship where they are using real tools, uh, re uh, cutting-edge technologies, solving tickets, um, solving issues, building infrastructure, mm -hmm. so they can get the hands-on. Mm -hmm. And this is coupled with uh, uh, um, being uh, uh, accompanied with a dedicated um, career success coach to help them. We do a lot of mock interviews with them. We make sure they actually 
get the kinks out with us, mm -hmm. not with the actual hiring manager, you know, under stress. I love it. Uh, they, we, we try to help them, you know, manage that stress, manage uh, um, how they deliver. Because there is a difference between knowing what you're talking about and being able to articulate Later. what you're talking about. You and, know? and that's one thing that I, I really love about this is you're not just going to um, get the education. You're getting the education and the hands on, which is why mm -hmm. I believe your hiring rate is so high. Yeah. And for, for our Cloud for Jobs program, um, um, for example, for the year 2024, we are only uh, um, um, allowing 80, 80 students in. Only 80. So wait, wait. throughout the year 2024, yeah. you're only doing 80. 80. Uh, pause. Mm -hmm. E3. I want all 80 of y'all in there. <laughs> Seriously. And, and, and the reason is um, most people, they start with the Linux for jobs. Okay. The Cloud for Jobs, it's definitely intended for someone with no IT background, but it requires a special co kind of commitment. Okay, what's that special commitment though? Talk to um, me. It, it requires ten, a good 10 hours of study a week. Okay, so that's two hours a day on a five-day week. Exactly, and uh, you, you need to be able to show up uh, to class, depending on the, what portion you are in the program, mm -hmm. three to four times a week. So okay. it requires, uh, uh, but always after hours, because okay. we cater uh, to the working uh, person. To the working person. Okay. And um, some, for some people, they have the money figured out, but mm -hmm. they don't have the bandwidth. Mm. You see? Mm. So, so that's why sometimes, even you, uh, you said something, and I find it too, too, uh, off, often true. Sometimes you have the money, they don't have the time. Sometimes it's not the right program for the person right now. Yep. But it's the right program for the person, for that same person next year. Yep. Yep. You know, you know what I mean? Uh, this, this is, this is, this is good, uh, and, and and I'm loving this because I don't feel like everyone watching this, this is for them. No, no, absolutely not. Absolutely and that's not. that's why I love it because I believe it's like okay, we're exposing yeah. something that is new, but we're being true. Like, hey, listen, you guys, if if you want to change your life, there's going to be work, and not everyone can put in the work that yeah. is needed for this. Exactly. 10 hours a week, that's real. No one on my show has ever said, hey, you come on here. If you can't give us 10 hours a week, don't even try. Yeah, yeah. And well, also, um, um, you have to um, take a couple assessment tests. Okay. Uh, computer literacy, basic computer literacy. But we need to understand that, that basic computer literacy exists. Mm -hmm. Because if not, uh, you're not going to be able to keep up with the program. What is basic computer literacy, people? Um, Typing without looking at the keyboard? No. Uh, attachment. Okay. How to send an email, how okay. to attach something, how to do a, a you know, a screenshot okay. with, uh, with, with, with uh, uh, um, your computer. These kind of things. What's that? Uh, command um, shift uh, three. It's four. It's four? On Mac? <laughs> On Mac. <laughs> Are you sure it's four? Try. Let me try. Command shift Nah, -uh. see, nah. -uh. Command Shift Four. Nah. Oh wait, you're right because I could draw on that one. But if I just do Command Shift Three, it takes the entire screen. Exactly. Screen. If you but want Command to Shift Four, four you two. can just choose. Two. So he know what he's talking about, <laughs> y'all. Yeah, I'm about to say, wait a minute. So I'm I never draw Command Shift Four though. Let me see that. Oh, got it. See. <laughs> God, oh, you just taught me something. <laughs> now I don't have to, because like, sometimes I'll do a command shift three, then and I got to go back and edit. It. Yeah, I got to crop it. <laughs> exactly. I can just do command. <laughs> Yellow tail is on point. So, okay, so now that's good. So it was like, you're doing, so is that part of the test? You need to know yeah, what I, command shift four is. No, 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 that's three. not, the, that's not, that's to illustrate. I got you. Okay. We use a third party company that does nothing but assess uh, 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 people. Okay. Okay. So we uh, send you a link for you to sit and, and do that assessment. Believe it or not, it's a 15-minute assessment. 15 minutes? Yeah. Wow. And it tells you if you are proficient, highly proficient, it puts you, you know, where you are. And what do y'all need? Proficient and, and higher? Uh, proficient for Linux. Okay. Um, highly proficient for uh, the Cloud for Jobs program. Okay. okay. And we also, uh, we test for for the... Uh, um, uh, 
critical thinking portion for both program, but we uh, look for very specific numbers for the cloud for jobs. Okay. Uh, because there is a, a bell curve where, it, where when you fall into a very specific area, mm -hmm. the, the, uh, it predicts that you can uh, do uh, things that are computer, uh, computer science related. Yes. And this company spends a lot of, uh, uh, of uh, effort um, generating that data. We're just using the data to actually be able to help us predict uh, the people we enroll are going to be the people who actually get jobs. Love it. You see? Love it. Because um, this marketplace, what's prevalent is cheap options. Because that, by the way, that's what the marketplace is asking for. How can I do this fast, cheap. for the cheap, and make, go make the most money? Mm -hmm. So now the the consumer is asking for that. Guess what is going to happen? Mm -hmm. People are going to start offering you what you ask for. Mm -hmm. And I told Paloma, my wife, when we started, we are going to only sell what works. Mm -hmm. We are not going to sell what people want to hear. Mm -hmm. That's what I really wanted to ask you about Yellowtail. What what separates you? Because I mean. Um, you're very equivalent to one of my partners that I have, Bethel Tech, but they don't offer this stuff and they're very solid. But it's like when I look at your program compared to other programs out there, what makes you special when it comes to the AWS and the Linux stuff? Uh, first, um, not a lot of um, companies are offering Linux and AWS as an option in the for, the cohort format. You're going to find it more in the self-based platforms that you pay $50 a, a month and then you get courses. Mm -hmm. We are cohort-based. You start with a cohort, we end with, with a cohort. Mm -hmm. You see what I mean? We keep you moving. Yes. Uh, the second thing that makes us different is that we give you the contextual knowledge because we are not in the business of uh, training one-trick ponies. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, because that's what a lot of places do. They give you exactly the right amount you need to get the job. Mm -hmm. And then if anything changes in the job, now you, you're like cut in the, in, uh, you know, and uh, 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 trapped. So we give you a uh, uh, foundational knowledge like networking, uh, uh, IT infrastructure. We make sure you know um, all the tools that are contextual to what you're gonna do. Not yes, only Linux, not only cloud, but the contextual tools. Yes, sir. So we try to give you a very uh, um, holistic uh, uh, training. Yeah. That's why our training are longer. That's why uh, they require more time. Yeah. That's why also we, we include the apprenticeship as part of the program. So uh, we try to offer something a little more complete. Love it. And um, when I finished uh, at, under the University of Maryland, I, I wasn't happy with, a, with the uh, career support I got. So that's actually why I called my program Linux for Jobs and okay. Cloud for Jobs. Because I didn't feel they insisted enough on the job part of, yeah. the, uh, of, of helping me. Okay. Because I came to University of Maryland to get a degree, to get a job. Yes. Yeah. But they are in the business of helping you get the degree, not necessarily get helping you get the job. Ooh, so I'm like, yeah. I'm going to call. So we never forget why we're doing this. I'm going to put job, you know, as part of the name of the program. Yes, sir. So uh, we focus on that part, you know, the job part. Of the of the of, of the process, we help you. We have a very solid and and um, robust um, career uh, coaching mm -hmm. as part of the program as well, integrated mm -hmm. as part of the program. So the, uh, these are all the uh, things we've looked at. We've iteratively improved in the past uh, um, ten, if you counting the two years we've been doing uh, we've been doing this with our friends, eight. If you're just counting the, uh, the, uh, the years we've actually been in business offering this to the public. So since that, since th those years, we've been improving every year. Yeah. You know, um, sometimes I feel, you know, I've cheated my, my students who, who, who trained with me five years ago. The mm -hmm. program has evolved and improved so much. <laughs> you see what I mean? Yeah. yeah. So someone gets in your program and they go through this cohort and with the cohort, 
do you all once they get done just leave them just leave them out there or do you all honestly are a part of their journey to help oh, them yes. get into Oh yes. We are not only part of the journey, we actually uh, uh, show it in a different way. We have a tuition reimbursement program. Say it so. Um, that's not even required. Um, yeah, but it's it's a way to say that I'm committed. Wow. If you don't land a job within six months of completing your apprenticeship, uh, we give your money back. Say, well, hold on. Wait, pause, pause, pause. Rewind. Rewind. Jay, rewind that all the way again, because I'm going to hold him accountable to this yes. thing right here. Um, People pay. Since we started. Yellowtail, if you don't land a job within six months, six months after your apprenticeship. Yeah. So mm -hmm. technically, this could be anywhere between, depending on which With program, program. You, get in, mm -hmm. you get into, exactly. it could be 12 to 18 months yeah. after you started your program. Mm -hmm. If you don't have a job, you get your money back. Yes. Why? Yeah. Why are you so strong with that, though? It's, like why? Are, why do you offer that? Because this is the only way um, I thought to actually uh, make me better every day. <clears throat> because now every day I have to wake up and understand how do I make this program, this offering, better to live up to that. Juby, this is good, Juby. Yeah, this is. But good. but I have to say we put guidelines in place because yep. some people come, they BS their way through the program. Facts, facts. Um, and then they're like, yeah, where's that, where's that job Guarantee you promised? It. Right, right, right. You see what I mean? So you put guidelines yeah. and systems and strategies in place that you gotta, you gotta check off each and exactly. every Exactly, and they have to review them, be comfortable with the guidelines, mm -hmm. agree to them before they enroll. That's so good, though. Yeah, you see what I mean. Yeah. Uh, we are very transparent. So I want to say we have a tuition reimbursement guarantee, but we have guidelines to make it fair for both parties. Mm -hmm. And you're gonna have access to it. You're gonna be able to review it uh, before you enroll. <laughs> but it is there. It is there to keep me accountable. Yeah. To basically, I want to walk the talk. Mm -hmm. You see what I mean. Since you've started this program, what's one of the greatest success stories that has come from this program? Oh, yeah, I have one. Uh, shout out to Chip. He's going to probably see that. I remember... Um, How old is Chip? Chip is probably 35 now. He was a, a, a car salesman. Okay. And back then, I was doing this in person before COVID. I had a, I had a space as big as your uh, um, studio or bigger. Mm -hmm. um, and um, he, I used to um, advertise in supermarkets. And one day he just sh uh, showed up at his nearest supermarket and then he saw my advertisement. He came, he enrolled another friend. He's like, for some reason, this training is, tell, uh, you know, is the one I need to take. They came, I didn't have to convince them. He got a job, and then six months after the job, he got to be able to get a mortgage in a, in a neighborhood he wanted to be. Now he's able to send his kids to the, to the, to the, you know, to the school, the district that he had with. And he, t he, he called me to tell me thank you. <clears throat> you see what I mean? <clears throat> because to me, it's the closest thing you can do to a miracle is to help someone change social economic status so drastically. Mm. Mm. Someone who was literally making forty, thirty-five, forty thousand dollars, and they are, you know, all of a sudden making seventy-five, eighty thousand dollars. It's a big jump. Huge. It's a big jump, Huge. and it can have m big an impact on you and your family. Yeah. Yeah. You know, you can be in a better uh, uh, school district. You can take your, your, your kids to vacations that you, you couldn't afford before. Yeah. I, I, you know, I even keep the cards. I, I get handwritten cards, thank you cards from my students. Yeah. Where their life has completely changed. Yeah, yeah. You know, now they, some of my students, they have um, kids that need spe uh, special needs kids. Yeah, yeah. Now they have a flexible schedule where they can work from home, uh, you know, um, manage their kids and still be productive. Yeah. 
because of uh, the remote uh, aspect of the job. Yeah. So there are multiple. And by the way, this is the most interesting part of my job. Seeing those results, but not only the results of jobs, but the results of how those jobs help improve people's life. Mm. You know, and in and, and very different ways, you know, in different situations, but it does. Yeah. Yeah. You know, so to me, it, 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 that's, that's what keeps me going. No, I, that makes me smile to hear that yeah. a young man was able to go from selling cars because I know that world. You work six days. You have Sundays off. You're there at 8 a.m. closing at 8 p.m. every day. You yeah. get paid once a month on the 15th of every month. Well, in between the 10th and the 15th, depending on when they close the books and how they cut the check. Yeah. And if you're a good sell car salesman, you're making a hundred thousand dollars yeah, a year. But him, he was in parts. He was, he was selling in parts. Yeah, but by the way, I didn't know that. In the part department, you actually are selling. Yeah, yeah. You, you, there's a lot of upsell sales. going on. There's, you're on commission. The whole works. Everybody's yeah. in sales. Yeah, in the car salesman. Even I didn't. He told car me that. Washes. I didn't. I didn't know that. Oh, absolutely. But even parts is like. It's 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 just a headache. You're you're still there long hours, and yeah. and to to be able to come back and have that flexibility, to be able to, to transition your family from one neighborhood to another neighborhood, to go from one school to another school, forget the eighty thousand dollars. That's wellness and peace that you now have, because he was willing to take the time to go through a program, to learn. Yeah. And because he was willing to go through a program and to learn, it changed his whole financial future. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. And I just wonder how many of you all are, are listening to this right now and you're saying, you know what? I don't know. I, I got a question for you. He only has 80 slots for the rest of this year. There's thousands of you all watching this. And this ain't going to be for everybody. Yeah. And, and sometimes... Cloud for jobs is not necessarily the place for them to start. Mm -hmm. Linux is for the jobs place. is the place to start. And will you help them understand which program is best to start in? Yes. Okay. That's 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 what our enrollment advisors um, do. Okay. They make sure they track you to the right program. They make sure it's the right time. Okay. They make sure you're not taking a uh, debt that you can't afford. Yeah. They make sure you can afford, they can actually afford the program. Yeah. All these are taken into consideration. Good, 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 good. Do you have payment plans? Because you know my people don't really do student loans. <laughs> <laughs> Just being honest, do y'all do payment plans? We do payment plans, but um, we don't like it. Okay. Uh, but we have some options for them. We cool, have great. some options. How, how much is the program? Uh, the Linux for Jobs program is uh, ten. Thousand seven hundred and the bad. cloud for jobs is uh, seventeen thousand. It's an eleven months program and uh, not bad at apprenticeship. All. Yeah, not bad at all. Ten to seventeen thousand dollars, and you tell them I can have freedom. I'm curious on average when people get in within a year of getting a job, um, are the majority of those work from home? Majority, almost all of them. All of them are work from home. Even the ones that don't. A hundred percent work from home. They have a hybrid situation where yes. they probably go two days or one day a week or okay. every, you know, once in a while. Because some some companies they insist on a few days. Yeah. Uh, just because of uh, the company dynamics, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but not at all because you need to be there to do that job. Yeah. Yeah. If you have a laptop, you have a VPN, which is a virtual private network. Mm -hmm you should be able to do that job from wherever. Um, if they get the job, would the company provide them with, with their oh, yeah. computer and stuff? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. That's that's okay. But then they they probably would need that, though, with the apprenticeship, though, right? I'm Beforehand. Sorry. They would probably need a computer. Yeah, yeah the they program. would need a computer for the apprenticeship. Cool, cool, yeah. cool, cool, cool. Even for the, um, to the, start the program, they usually, you know, have to invest three two to $300 in a, in a new basic computer. Computer? Yeah. It's not bad. Well, you guys, I, I want to encourage you to uh, pray on it.
you know, and consider signing up for the program. I can almost guarantee you we're going to we're going to pack him out on the 80. Um, so I feel sorry for uh, any other people that's also promoting Yellowtail. But <laughs> my, my people are going to get into it because I believe that you all need to like this is the I don't know where else you can go to get this quality for AWS and Linux. I've heard about AWS. I never heard about Linux. I'm gonna be honest about that. Um, and I've it's funny how Linux, there couldn't be uh, uh, AWS without, without Linux. Linux. Yeah. yeah. So, so I'm loving it. I'm loving it. I'm loving yeah. it. So you guys, we're gonna drop their information in the show notes. I want you all to go check it out. Yeah. And the one last thing I want I want to say is that one Think one other problem we are trying to solve in this marketplace is mm -hmm. that we notice a lot of people are interested in IT, mm -hmm. but they don't have a community. Mm. You know, their family, their neighbor do not know how to uh, uh, support them. Mm -hmm. So we are building a community called Accelerate. Yes. Where um, you just come in because one thing we, sh we realize is that people know about IT, but they don't have necessarily the passion for it right. because they don't understand, they're not exposed to it enough. Mm -hmm. And sometimes they need an accountability partner. Yeah. Sometimes it's because they want to uh, um, see someone who looks like them, who's in a, the same community. Yeah. So we are also building a community uh, where um, people before or during the program, they can actually be part of, mm -hmm. you know, to actually get that accountability going, to find an accountability partner, to keep uh, being exposed to uh, uh, this, uh, um, this thing called technology. Because um, the biggest, in my 10 years in this business, the biggest thing that uh, people uh, struggle with is finding the passion mm. for the process. Mm -hmm. And they forget, or they sometimes don't know, passion is built. Yeah, You don't just show up and then you become passionate about IT. Yeah, You build passion by learning, by exposing yourself, by immersing yourself in tech, by consuming tech every day, by talking about tech to your friends, by being in, around people who's always talking about tech yeah. and you get passionate about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see what I mean? Yeah. So uh, the community we're building is to help generate excitement and passion about, uh, about tech, even if you're not ready to jump in right now, but uh, this community is gonna be here to actually just help you navigate, understand the tech uh, space in general. You know, community is important. Yeah. I mean, it takes a village to raise a child. I think it takes a village to help us reach our goals. Yeah. And so if 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 you're in the tech industry or if you're interested in the tech industry and you just don't know how to get into it just yet, exactly. you need to get around the people. Exactly. You're on the fence. You want to know more. You want to uh, get some live workshop. You want to uh, meet up with your uh, local people. Yeah. You know, um, that are interested too, that are, you know, that need that accountability. Yeah. This is the platform. It's this. called Accelerate. Okay. Um, we are. Um, is there any fee for this community? It's going to, there is going to be a fee, but uh, for now, uh, we are um, just have, we just have a wait list. Okay. Uh, we already have about uh, 500 people on that wait list. Okay. Um, we're going to launch it um, uh, in April. Okay. Um, so, yeah. It's a it's a community we want to uh, 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 you know grow. Um, it's just to support the process because people get lonely in in the journey. No, that's true. You see what I that's mean? That's so true. And that's the problem I'm trying to solve. Not only help the people who are committed, but commitment alone takes you so far. You know, the a community takes yes. you the rest of the way. Yes, hands down. No, hands down. I believe community is very, very important, which is why we started our E3 community. And I promise you that we're going to be sending people to your community as well, because I have a lot of people in our E3 community who um, are already actually in tech or considering tech. Yes. Because I believe the two best industries for people to get into right now to generate more income is the content creation space and tech. Yeah. That's just the two fields that I believe that if you steward the money well. Yeah. By the way, last... Uh Last week you shared a post about 
how you can make great money in other spaces mm -hmm. that people are not talking about. Yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah. tech is the new sexy thing in town, but it's not the only thing. Absolutely. Take it from someone who is in tech. Yeah, yeah. You know, because I, I hate to see someone transition uh, transition into tech when they should be a creator. Yeah, yeah. Great. <laughs> I totally you agree. You see what I mean? Which is why I love it, how you're saying, hey, I'm not for everybody. No, no, this no. This information is for everybody as far as in, because I think anything that you do, right, you need to have passion about it. You need to have a community about it. Um, and you need to be assessed. Like in, anything that you do, you got to have those things. But if we're going to make money, I think that a lot of people, and correct me if I'm wrong, if you disagree, I think a lot of people have talked themselves out of tech, not because it's not for them, but because they hear the word tech and they think code, they think exactly. all this stuff. And I'm like, no, it's yeah. it's not that. So that's why that's the that's what the community is gonna help with. Mm -hmm. Help you navigate the nuances. Yeah. You can be in tech and not be coding. You can be in tech and not be uh, um, dealing with cloud. You yes. can be in UX design and still use your creative side of your brain. Yeah. You can be in tech and be talking to people. Yeah. yeah. My wife got in tech because she was tired to talking to humans. <laughs> <laughs> because she was in social science before. I got Some you. people go in tech to, for the opposite because they'd like to be talking more to people. Well, you can be in uh, project management. Wow, yeah. Tech, project manager, you can be a scrum master. Yeah. What I mean is uh, there is a lot of nuances and the, uh, the whole idea of the community is to expose you to all these nuances mm. and make sure you go with our program or not. Yeah. But you make the right decision. You have people around you. You have all the information. You have the community around you to actually help you navigate yes. that. No, I love it, man. I love it. I love it. Man, it's been a great show, you guys. Hey, you're going to see a lot more of Yellowtail uh, within our brand because we just believe in what they're doing. Well, I'll play this. You'll see a lot more of them until we hit that 80, which <laughs> I think we'll hit that 80 here soon uh, because every every class, every session that you're starting here soon, what, how many people are in that one? Uh, we keep them in pods of um, 10 to 15 students. Got you. That way. That is uh, so dope though. Yeah. So it doesn't, it doesn't stretch your teachers. Exactly. And they and, have and, uh, all the access. Yes. Wow. Oh, yeah. Well, so that's, that's this yeah, next yeah. one, we only got 15. <laughs> and then you gotta get on to the next one, right? So let's, let's, let's go ahead and flood him with these 15, you guys. Um, and, and come back. I want you to come back and, and give me uh, your reviews of Yellowtail. Yeah. And that's just what I want to do. The first person from our community to go on Yellowtail, I want to, and that completes the program and lands a job, I want to fly them here uh, to DC and I want to interview you and just talk about your whole experience. I'd love that. Throughout the process. I think that'd, that'd be, be cool. great. Yeah, just to have someone on hand saying, yo, I did it. I found out through the E3 community. I joined the accelerated community. I, I went through the Linux, Linux program or the AWS program. I got a job. They helped me out with this. I, I want to know. I yeah. want to know because I want to hold I one, me account accountable, Yellowtail accountable and share. Okay. This is the actual stuff that's going on. Because again, like I told you at the beginning of the show, the only way we're going to experience financial freedom is if we honestly find a vehicle and a, and or a tool that will help us get there. And I'm always going to be trying to find and exposing different re avenues for us to make money. And so um, I want to encourage you to click the link in today's show notes. Go learn more about it. Go apply. Go do the assessment. And we're going to have a good one. But Juby, man, thank you so much for coming. Thank, thank you. you for your heart, bro. Thank you. Thank you. you know thank what I'm you saying? for having me, man. No, no I, I had to have you on because there's not too many black people in your space who have a passion about teaching this with quality, you know, and, and you're like, hey, I don't want a lot of people. I want the right people. Yeah. Because if I can get the right person, I can get them placed yeah. and then I can go help more people. Exactly. Who needs it? And it's actually better for business yeah too. yeah it's like it. It, it it's better for everyone in the process all right in the process man love you man appreciate you you guys will see you in the next show go check out the link it's in the show notes god bless y'all